everyone. Hi, my name is Anthony Gao. I representative uh, to the urgency network from China, and uh, so I was quite proud that I'd be invited to join this event. And uh, to introduce myself first, I joined the Shared Harvest of Beijing, which is the most influenced the CSA farm of China as a consumer since 2011. And uh, it was huge change to my life that uh, after I joined the CSA lifestyle system, I find the healthy and the organic food is the key to people who want to live in, in sustainably and environment friendly. I was also trying to find out the, some the reasons why people living in China has the same habits and the daily schedules as they living abroad. That's uh, for example as me. And uh, maybe 10 years ago, I used to study uh, in Sydney, Australia. And uh, I keep the same living habits that's the same as when I back to China, Be Beijing. But terrible is that I, I suddenly found uh, I got a the terrible feel, feel physical conditions and uh, the weight is get higher. Uh, I, I don't know why, so, so I'm trying to find out, <laughs> I'm trying to find out the, what happened. That's the, finally, when I joined the CSA's network, I got the crit critical is the food. Today in China, due to the food safety problems and uh, many of others like the challenger of the agriculture sustainability and the, the middle class or urbanizations more and the more Chi Chinese pe peoples seeking for the food to perceive to the healthy and the safe and the environmental friendly. And uh, for three years experience that I joined the CSA as the consumers, I have the strong willing to make a big contributes more to the CSA develop developments all over the China. As the expertise of the advertising and the marketing background, I found that the priorities on the to-do list in China is how to awake people's awareness of sustainable living and the sense of food rights. We shall provide a more choice in food environmental to Chinese peoples by CSA module. We are working to build up the best practice between CSA farm and the consumers help to create stronger relationship. Okay, as I have two great news. That's the, it, the first is it is great the within past years, the CSA farm in China are raised from around 500 to 800. It's a nearly more than 50% increased. Most of these farms are small scale organic farm, but there are other different modules, including like the box schemas. And the, it also a great news is the sixth international CSA conference will be held in Beijing, China in this November. This conference is jointly organized by the International CS Network Urgencies and the Chinese CS Network together. It aims to strengthen links between CSA members and the farmers, researchers, and the activities around the world. This event is also an opportunity to share urgency strategies and uh, expectations with our key ally from the food uh, sovereignties and the organic movements. This is the first time the international level submit to step about the organic agriculture step into China, which is the traditional agriculture countries. We also looking forward to this important event act as a huge awareness rising campaign to help more and more Chinese people reach their sustainable living, to maintain the food services and the least CSA get it, get it.
get a better development in China. So if anybody interested in this big campaigns, you can visit the website name with www.icsac.cn. It's all. Thank you.